welcome back to my channel. Today I'm excited to introduce you all to my books. I decided about six months ago to lock my hair um, and I decided to use the method of doing little plaits throughout all of my hair and just letting it lock from there then interlocking it as it grew out. Um, initially, I, you know, I can admit, I was interested in sister locks. However, A, I didn't want to pay. B, um, I just really like to do things myself. So, at first, I started out with very, very small two-strand twists. And two of my best friends were helping me install that, install those. And then I decided that, um, well, I saw that with one of my friends. She had locked her hair recently, and she did hers with two strand twists. And hers expand. I noticed that the um, twist expands a lot more and frizzes out a lot quicker than with braids. So I decided to go back and turn the twist that we had done. We'd only done maybe like this back section of my head. But I turned the twist that we had done into plaits and then plaited the rest of my hair. This took several weeks and I did miss a few. So there are some um, locks within here, maybe five to 10 that I missed that are still two strand twist. And those locks have definitely um, started to form quicker or to become locked or they look more like locks than the ones that started with that I started with plaits. Um, but I don't mind it. I don't need all of my hair to look the same necessarily. I think it looks interesting. Um, so yeah, so that took a while, but it was definitely worth it. I love the results. Um, I decided to lock my hair just because I wanted that when I took my wigs off or weaves out. Well, I really don't wear weaves too much, but mainly wigs off. I wanted to love the hair that I had going on underneath. Now I've never really minded my natural hair, like it was fine, but I never like loved it. I didn't love it because I felt like I put so much effort when I would wear it out. I put so much effort into trying to make it look um, a certain way or get a certain style achieved and I was never fully satisfied with how that was coming out. Now I can definitely admit that um, the issue, one issue was that while I was wearing weaves or wigs, not wearing my hair out, I would admire other people's um, natural hair styles, but then when I would try it on me, it wouldn't come out the same, obviously because no two heads of hair are the same, but I spent too much time at looking and observing other people's hair and be like, okay, so when I do this, it should come out like this. That wasn't the case, so I was just never happy. So that's why I wore not that's not, I guess that's not why I wore weaves all the time. I wore weaves all the time because I just like to switch it up. But that's why I just didn't wear my natural hair out very often because I was never satisfied with the results I was getting. Now I can say, and I'm proud and happy to finally be at a point where when I take my weaves off or whatever I really like I really love what's going on up underneath not only that but it's super easy like all I do is pull these back into like a ponytail um, or a little bun or do two little braids I can wear my wig for the day or whatever for the week I will wear wigs for weeks at a time whatever and then when I'm ready to take it off take it off and flip these out and I'm good to go like it just doesn't take a whole lot um, when I wash my hair all I have to do is shampoo it sometimes I condition it and let it dry and that's it I do use leave-in conditioners and that's it I'll put it into like a, a ponytail or a bun or something while it dries and then I'm done I'm done um, so I wear my hair out for like a week and then I'll wear a wig for like a week, maybe two. And then I'll wear my hair out for another week, maybe two. And I just switch it on and off like that. Um, I'm still gonna be wearing wigs for as long as I can until these get um, too thick or too long to be able to fit the wig over it. Just because I do still like to switch it up. I'm not quite ready to wake up and see the same thing every single day. I'm not quite ready for that, but I'm getting there. Uh, let's see. So I've had my hair retightened four or five times. The first few times I did it myself, or I got help from like my mom or my friends, 
it took way too long and I had to get over the whole like oh I just do my hair myself I had to get over that because it was ridiculous so my cousin who has sister locks her sister locks consultant agreed to um, retighten my hair for me and I just praise God for her because it's amazing I've been to her twice. I get get it retightened every five to six weeks. I've been to her twice, and it, she's uh, relatively new, so it takes her about five hours to retighten my hair. But I will take five hours over uh, several nights in a row. And it was just great because when I would retighten it myself, I would do some, but then by the time I finished the whole thing, it was almost time to retighten where I had started already. So it's great to go to her, get it all done at once, have all of my hair on the same page, basically. And yeah, I love it. Um, as far as growth goes, I can really tell that the back has grown out a lot when I stretch it. And I can tell in the front when I stretch it that it's grown out, but when it sits, I really can't tell and I have done a crappy crappy job at documenting this journey I'm sorry I suck um, so but I'm from here on out I'm gonna be taking more pictures and more videos of the transformation of my hair just so like not just for YouTube's sake but just for me so that I can see it and really appreciate the journey because if, if you don't have documentation you'll really just feel like you see yourself every day so you'll just feel like oh like nothing's changing it's not growing but in reality it really is so pictures and videos are key if you are interested in starting a lock journey journey of some sort um, comment if you have any questions comment if you also have braid locks comment um, I would love to see your pictures and videos um, if you follow me on Instagram um, eventually I'll start posting more sister oh no I don't have sister locks more micro lock I guess braid lock photos um and i would like to get connected with more people that are also on this journey i think it's beautiful i am excited and yeah i will see you guys next time bye bye deuces